My name is uh, Dr. Barham Obadeya. I'm one of the gastroenterologists and advanced endoscopists here at the Mayo Clinic. I'm excited to talk to you uh, today about uh, a new uh, area we're offering at the Mayo Clinic, which is endoscopic treatment for obesity and revision of gastric bypass surgery. Uh, obesity is a big uh, public health problem for us both uh, in the U.S. and worldwide. Uh, it's estimated that one in every uh, three American is obese with a BMI above uh, 30, which is uh, BMI is a body mass index. Uh, unfortunately, uh, lifestyle modification have uh, failed to address the magnitude of the uh, obesity problem. Also, uh, medication that targets obesity have either have uh, marginal uh, benefit or unacceptable side, uh, side effects to be applied for the big portion of our, of, uh, our population with this disorder. Uh, bariatric surgery, uh, namely uh, row y gastric bypass surgery and sleeve gastrectomy shows the most promise in achieving significant and sustained weight loss uh, and diabetes resolution. However, with any surgery, there's the risks of complication, there's the uh, costs associated with the surgery, uh, and uh, oftentimes these surgical procedures are not reversible. Our understanding how gastric bypass surgery and other bariatric procedure works have really evolved over time. Now we know that altering different segments of the gastrointestinal tract uh, results in changing the neurohormonal signals between these segments and the brain liver, pancreas, and other, organ, uh, and other organs, with the end results uh, being uh, improved satiety, uh, increased metabolism, and oftentimes improvement, if not resolution, of diabetes. Uh, capitalizing on this information, I'm excited to say that in GI or in the field of endoscopy, we now possess the tools to replicate some of these benefits and some of these alterations that bariatric surgery produce with the added benefit of this not being surgery. It's all done endoscopically through an endoscope without surgical scars or incisions. Uh, on top of this, uh, these procedures are uh, minimally invasive and uh, the patient usually uh, is able to uh, resume their regular uh, activity uh, shortly after the procedure. And oftentimes these endoscopic procedures are reversible. Uh, three of the uh, procedures that we are offering at the Mayo Clinic currently uh, for the primary treatment of obesity are, uh, one is uh, reducing the size of the stomach uh, in a similar fashion as a sleeve gastrectomy, but endoscopically using an endoscopic suturing device, what we call sleeve gastroplasty. Uh, another procedure is we place an endoscopic liner into the small intestines that prevent food from uh, uh, mixing with uh, gastrointestinal and digestive secretions until later in the GI tract. And finally, we also offer for the primary treatment of obesity an aspiration procedure where we place a tube into the, into the stomach and allow the patient to aspirate part of their ingested meal uh, and get rid of these excess calories as a long-term management of their uh, weight. And that, uh, these three procedures are currently available at the Mayo Clinic on research basis as a part of multi-center uh, research studies uh, involving other centers in the United States. Uh, and on top of these procedures at the Mayo Clinic, we also offer revision for uh, raw y gastric bypass surgery to treat weight regain that results from either an increase in the size of the gastric pouch or increase of the diameter of the outlet that connects the pouch and the small intestines. Uh, we are able to reduce the size of either the pouch or the outlet endoscopically using an endoscopic suturing system or using a chemical that reduces the, uh, or using a chemical that we inject at these structures to reduce their size. So these are some of the new avenues that the, uh, that's available to our patients uh, at the Mayo Clinic. Uh, if you would like any further information, don't hesitate to contact us uh, about either the uh, primary treatments for obesity or uh, procedures to uh, treat weight regain after raw y gastric bypass surgery.